Hi, today we're talking about how to use a Shelton fish descender, which is a descending device. Descending devices can be used on reef fish that show signs of barotrauma, such as bulging eyes, a bloated belly, distended intestines, or the stomach coming out of the mouth. If fish show those signs, you can help get them back down to the bottom using descending devices, and you should only use the device if they show those symptoms. So the Shelton fish descender is an inverted hook device that can be attached to a separate rod and reel. And you want to make sure that this is rigged up before you're fishing so that you're ready to descend the fish. Because the faster you are at getting the fish back in the water, the better chance it has of surviving. To set up your Shelton fish descender, there's a lot of options. But one way you can do it is you can attach line here to the top at this swivel. And then at the bottom, you can attach um, some sort of snap or some way to get some weight on the device here. And one to three pounds of weight should be sufficient. It just depends on what size fish you're going to be descending. And so when the fish is going down through the water column back to depth where it can recompress, the device is gonna look like this with the point facing downward. In order to put the fish on here, and you're gonna take the point and try to put it through the hole that was made by the hook. Once you have that done, you can carefully set the entire rig into the water. You want to leave some slack in your line so that it doesn't snap and cause the fish to come off early. But once you get that in the water very carefully and let it descend, you want to get down to at least 40 to 70 feet or deeper if the fish was caught from deeper water than 100 feet. Once you get back down to that depth, you can snap up on the line quickly. That will pull the device out of the fish's mouth and allow it to swim away.